Hi all, Chris here and um, I'm at my dad's house in Canberra. I drove down and um, I picked up some sets on the way. I'll make more videos about those after this. Um, this is one of two sets I've picked up for a friend of mine up in Queensland. Well, the other ones um, I'll be picking up on the way back home, but um, and I'll be dropping them off at, for him. So it's an old 1950s, I'd guess I'd say 56, precedent 17 inch television. So it's in really rough shape. And I'm sure. I'm sure he'll be able to restore it. Beautiful cabinet. I really like the round design on it. Um, so yeah, I was just about 20 minutes from my dad's house. So yeah, that's a pretty good find. Um, I'll be so yeah, I'll be calling this back up in my use with me. So. It's a neat little set inside, EHT cage there, I can see a 6CM5, 6AL3, oh, I hate those, and most likely a, um, my phone is, dang, it's most likely a um, 1S2, or, yeah, there'd be a 1S2 half-wave rectifier in there. The tube there, roller deflection yoke, um, an ARTS and P sticker, uh, two fuses, various other tubes on the chassis, a bit of rust on the chassis, but all the tubes are there. Uh, some hefty transformers. The back cover is missing, which is a shame. And, Oh, that's a decent sized electro under there. Just got a little masonite panel under here, I'm guessing. I guess I'd say that. Yeah, you, it looks like you can probably take that out to service the chassis, like my SJ. So, yeah, but I'm not going to open it up because it isn't my set, so I'm not going to mess with it, but yeah. Um, it'd be interesting to see what's under the chassis, but yeah, it's a pretty neat one, so I just thought I'd make a quick video of it, because it's, I've never run into a precedent set before, so, yeah, so anyway, there it is, so cheers, Chris.